Welcome viewers, Zach here and welcome to the fourth round of the Row Racing Content Creator Clash. Today we are here at Hungary, a track that I'm not really good at, but I've had a lot of practice and I'm really confident for this race. And here is my full qualifying lap. And with qualifying out the way, it was time for the race. And as you may have noticed, there were only four races and already that is not a good sign. However, I decided just to ignore the fact there's only four of us and let's make most of this race. Let's try and get a win for our team. It was lights out and away we go. I managed to jump um, Zoo and get second place and we are behind Ro Arthur. The race is going pretty well and I've practiced this track a lot so I'm very confident. However, I go a bit wide there. So, well, almost losing P3 but I think we still got some steady pace going on and for some reason he's a bit slow and we jump and here we are in P1. We temporarily lose it but can we hold on to it? We go drift a bit wide. We take a corner a bit wide. We deploy our ERS and we were in the lead just like that. But the question is, for how long can we keep it? There's only four races and I think... Well, all of them are faster than me, but let's see what we could do. Oh, you can see that Ro Arthur went a bit wide there. I got a better line than him, which means I keep the lead. This is great news so far, but there are still another 20, 20 something laps to go. So let's get to it. All right, we are here on lap four, and unfortunately, Ro Arthur has managed to overtake us. We're in P2, and we can still win this race. He's right in front of us. Let's see who can do this better. I'm using a bit of regen, trying to get those better exits. And let's see who gets a better exit here. I go for this line. However, I go a bit too wide, and the car spins. I just catch the car, but I'm losing so much time. And he makes a mistake as well, which means we haven't lost too much time against him. But then I take this corner really badly, and he gets the lead, and yeah. And here we are on lap six and at this point I was kind of struggling and I realized that the rear tires were suffering because I kept pushing the car through the corners and all of a sudden there's a safety car which is perfect that means I can go in the pits and pit for another medium tire the problem is with Hungary because there's so many corners to turn through it really does it on the tire wear which means that uh, you know pit strategy wise it's going to be a bit of a problem i think the other drivers were suffering this as well you can see ro arthur even he pit as well even though it's practically still too early but there wasn't much else we could do okay we are here at the end of the safety car and i'm slowing down a bit i don't know where ro arthur has gone i think he's right behind me but we just go it's green flags when we just run away and for some reason we've had a much much better um exit than arthur did i don't know where arthur went and since i got this advantage i thought to myself Let's make most of it. Let's try Let's try our best save the tires. But then, for some reason, I went wide and I lost so much time that um, the other drivers caught up to me. Okay, here we are on lap 14. And honestly, I think maybe I should have pit at this time. But I thought that, now nah, I could just push it one more lap, maybe. You know, try and save on the strategy. Maybe go on the hard tires or something. It was just really difficult because, you know, you want to save the tires. You don't want to pit too much. Otherwise, you're going to lose weight way too much gut time against the other drivers so i thought let's push the car and then i go over the bump you can tell the tires are really struggling i tried to do everything try and keep the car in a straight line and trying not to get too much oversteer like for example through this corner i'm just taking it really nice and steady that might not have been the best strategy but honestly it was kind of working for me like that 
All right, so we're here later on in the lap, and I thought, all right, let's just be careful with the car. Let's pit, and let's go for the overcar. It was pretty nice to be in P1, and I thought maybe I could even go for the win. But then... Hello. Hello. This is Mattia Binotto. I thought you were fired. Your free trail of a working Ferrari engine is over. Wait, what? 